What do I consider success? There's a lot of ways to measure that and evaluate it. Competition is one of them. We're a competitive activity, so everybody wants to know, what place did you take? So that is a part of it. But how did we do, in our opinion, how did the kids do? Did those kids maximize their potential? Because that's really what it's about. Are we able to maximize our potential for what these kids can do? And if we think that they did, we are successful. When you know within yourself that there's something you want to do, and I believe that all of us were born with a purpose, that all of us have something that we are supposed to do, that all of us have some goodness within us, and that goodness gives us a responsibility to manifest our greatness. Not only is it possible for you to have your dream, but it's necessary. It's necessary that you have it, that you work on it, that you develop yourself that you go for what is yours in the universe. Every single day when you wake up, you better be spending time on your dream. You better be spending time on your dream. You ain't got time to waste. It is a sense of urgency. It's a character of who you are. It's not the title that makes you. It's not the success that makes you. The character defines the success, defines the fame, and it starts right there. The Harvard champion is a light switch that's always on. It doesn't go on and off when someone's watching. It's constant. It's how you look at something. If your name's attached to it, then you do it right. The best of your ability every single time. You hear all about learning discipline and self-control, time management. But the most important thing that I think that I've learned through Spirit of Atlanta is being able to push myself. When I feel like I shouldn't be able to go further or can't go further, you can go further. And that's something that I've learned here. It just, it takes discipline and it takes self-control. And once you learn those two skills, you can really see how far you can go and amaze yourself. There's no easy way around it. No matter how talented you are, your talent is gonna fail you if you're not skilled. If you don't study, if you don't work really hard and dedicate yourself to being better every single day. Right now, I feel like this is gonna be the best of all my years. And I can say that with confidence. And we're just gonna take this thing and I'm gonna push as hard as I possibly can to make sure that we're doing everything in our power to be as successful as we can. Total success doesn't come from the green shirts and the score and the placement. We're gonna to talk to those kids every single day about that. Now, let's try to get better. Let's do one thing better. Don't worry about 10 things. Get one thing better. But when 150 people do one thing better, boom. Spirit of Atlanta 2014. No shortcuts, no excuses. Let's do this.